this is H.J. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics! Since last time, I went all the way to the other side of Ivalice, and we're heading back home. Alright. Uh, the only changes that I've made to my setup are I put Ignore Height on Ramza and Krona there. So, But otherwise, my setup is pretty much what it's going to be for the remainder of the game, really. So... Well, that's not suspicious at all. I thought uh, the Bial of Ka or Egros was like a huge castle, like we saw when uh, they were trying to kill Dysodog. The in Chapter One, the Death Corps. What's what? Doesn't it kind of defeat the purpose of having a gate to your castle if the if the doorknob is on the outside? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I, I'm not an expert on home security systems. Yeah, I know. It's a real shock, viewers. Okay, so for this battle, let's see. I'm still going to bring out the uh, Big Daddy for this one. Sorry, viewers. Uh, but I do need uh, a weapon-breaking ability for this one. And that should be good. Well, Zalbeg looks like he's already beat us to the punch here. I hate the spelling of Egros Castle in the PSP version. I actually don't like a lot of the spellings. Although a lot of that, I admit, is probably because I'm just so used to the PlayStation version. I've played this game so many times. You are under arrest, Chancellor. I mean, uh, brother. You like my, uh, who is Mace Windu's after? Uh, Samuel L. Jackson impression? I almost said Wesley Snipes, but uh, <laughs> now that wouldn't be right. Can you imagine Wesley Snipes as Mace Windu? I don't think so. Well, he's our father, unless Dysodarg is a bastard too. Well, for more reasons than one. What do you mean, the Duke? Uh, no, I don't know. Oh, you mean Lard, okay. Well, it's nice to know that you actually have a brain in your head there, Zalbag. Took you long enough to realize that Dysodarg was evil. Of course, he does have the style and uh, beard going there, so... That's... Hey, how's it going? Not looking too good for you, Zalbag. Let me help you out. Dysodarg's old elder brother! He has another one? No. No, that's just a typo there. Uh, uh, Ramza's elder brother. We have to defeat Dysodar. Okay, so first things first. For this battle, let's see. Let's go. One, two, three. Yeah, let's do that. That ought to be good enough. Uh, the problem with Dysodar, take a look at him. He's got sword skill, which basically, he has the holy sword stuff. So uh, we want to uh, take that out with Hellcry Punch. I could do that with Melia Duel, but I just got her, I think. I don't think I fought one storyline battle with her. This would be the first one. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going to grind her just for that. So, yeah, you want to take out his sword there real fast. And if I can, I'd like to take out one of these knights, too. That would be nice. That'll do. Hmm, I wonder if I used Earth Slash if I could have hit Dyson Arc from over here. Well, there we go. But now, unfortunately, as a Loon Knight, he also has access to all magic. That's his skill there, so that could be a bit of a problem. But for now, I'm going to, uh, let's see. What to do, what to do. Yeah, let's go up here. You don't want to get too close to Krona there, just in case, you know, they cast a spell on you or something like that. I don't know. Anything could happen. And eventually I might have uh, Ramza use Scream to boost his own mint. Whoa! boost his own woe power, apparently. I didn't expect that to deal that much damage. Yeah, yeah, I kind of knew that since chapter one, but, uh, well, nice to have you on board. More party members. Uh, Zalbeg is an Arc Knight, so he has, uh, well, different sword skills. Let's see what he's got. Oh, okay, I guess he's, uh, 
gonna reduce magic power, I guess. I suppose that's better than a sharp stick in the eye. Well, he just tried to put a sharp stick in his eye, but other than that, uh, knights are so horrible. Oh, it's like, what the hell are you doing? Well, now I can uh, blast them all. Let's see. Yeah, that ought to be good enough. Don't want to get too close. Yeah, I've got ignore height and teleport and everything around here. Let's see. I need a spell that's going to take longer. Nuts, I don't. Okay, never mind then. Can I avoid hitting him? Yeah, that'll do. I was hoping to have it take a little longer to uh, kill him, but no! Join the party there, Taku. Are you happy that I'm using your namesake now? <laughs> uh, let's see. Nothing I can do there. I wonder if I could silence him. Well, you know what? Let's stand pat for now. I'm going to make you stupider than you already were. Wow, that actually might be uh, really, really good. I wish I had something like that. Hmm. Let's see, not a whole lot I can do from here. Uh, why don't you stand pat there until that guy comes down from jumping? Wow, Orlando actually couldn't do anything without negating my other spell. Whoa, that didn't do much at all. Nuts. Well, Orlando's probably going to get his turn sooner or later. Ha ha! I was actually curious to see how much damage that would have de that would have dealt after, uh... Well, all the, uh, after uh, the Mind Break or whatever he did to him. Well, I'll use some other Holy Sword skills. Someone was asking me, H.C. Bailey, if you're gonna use Orlando, can you at least mix up the Holy Sword skills? So, sure, why not? I'm happy to oblige. Can I do... Can you do anything? Yeah, we're not that far up here. Earth Slash. I love that ability. I love anything that has 100% accuracy. I just hate missing. You insolent fools! Oh! Well... I guess they do explain that. I didn't think uh, Dysodarg was literally saying that he thought he could be king. In this version of the game, at least. Worthy! Er, wait. You're not worthy! You're not worthy! It works in real life. Well, we've almost killed you. Besides, once we kill you, he gets to be in charge. I wonder if they could clear Ramza's name if they really wanted to. Probably not. Let's see, can I kill him? Well, let's use Ultima. Why not? I spent all that time learning it. I better be able to do something useful. Of course, now he's pretty far away from Otaku. I was hoping I could... Uh, get slow on him and, you know, mix it up a little bit, but, oh well. Well, let's just get a little closer. Not too close, so. Hmm. Let's get a haste going. Or, do that. Haste Dual Fisted Ninja is my favorite combo in the game. Better than Excalibur on Orlando, because you get it way earlier than him. Let's see, can Let's see if I can even silence him. I mean, obviously, it's not useful now, but, uh... Hey, hey! All right! Let's go for it! Why not? Let's do something to him. Oh, that's an interesting skill set you got there. That drained his MP there. I wonder if he has enough MP to cast... Well, whatever spell he was going to cast. Okay, Orlando, uh... Well, just stare at him. Maybe he'll uh, die from it or something. I don't know. I could have finished him off, but, uh... Well, 
nah, not yet. Let's let him have some dignity. Pretend this battle was remotely challenging. Okay, now I've got my debuff on him. Okay, goodbye. You are the weakest link. Goodbye! Uh, why did they make me choose a dir Oh, right. And I would have gotten away for it with it too if it weren't for you dang meddling kids! I like how everyone's still dancing during this whole thing. Nuts. What is this, Power Rangers? It's like every time we kill a monster, he gets bigger. I didn't think they could just do that automatically, but well, apparently so. Or at least this time. Young fool. Only now at the end. You will pay the price for your lack of vision. That's... Where'd he go? You're not gonna tell me, are you? There's a reason oppose rhymes with dispose. Eh, this guy's not too hard. But I like how all these battles, it's like, we're... It's like Power Rangers, practically. You kill the monster, or whatever, and then you gotta fight a worse, an even worse monster, or something like that. Reminds me of, uh, one of the few Power Ranger series recently that I watched, uh, Dino Thunder, where Tommy's explaining to the new Rangers... Let me see, can I get that to... Yeah, that'll be fair. Tommy's explaining to the new rangers how, okay, this is how the jig works. You kill the monster, it grows for one various reason or another, you call your zords, and then you gotta kill the monster again. And I like how one of the ran new rangers that Tommy is mentoring in the series is like, you sound like you've done this before, and he just kind of has this amusing look on his face, or at least it was amusing to me. Or he's just like, yeah, once or twice. Even though he's done it like hundreds of times. I just found that amusing. You know what? That doesn't even phase me anymore. Hey, I've missed with a 80, or er, I've missed with a 94% uh, chance. So missing with an 85 or however many percent chance that was. That doesn't face me at all anymore. But let's at least get slow on him. Is he going to get a turn, like, ever? It would be nice if I could get one debuff so I could pretend I'm actually using some amount of strategy in this battle. There we go. Let's see. Let's go with Crush Punch. Why not? Mix it up a little bit. Oh, that was it? Oh. Sorry, I killed him too quickly, viewers. He wasn't getting a turn! It's not my fault! Oh, shit! Yeah, you might not want to uh, have come back into this world when uh, you were totally surrounded. Could have picked a better time. Well, yeah, pretty much. Would that mean Alma would be in charge since uh, Ramza has pretty much been, what's the word, excommunicated and Zalbag is missing? I mean, I, I mean, women seem to be in positions of authority. Except Ovelia. Why isn't she in charge anyway? I mean, that was, what, Goltana's whole claim that he was going to be her guardian or whatever, so that way he would become king, but isn't she old enough to make decisions and things, legal decisions and things like that? I, mean, I don't understand why, why she doesn't just say, okay, I'm tired of all this stuff, just, you know, let's kill the war, end it, we're, we're done. So anyway, what did that open up? 
Moran Holy Place. Why would we want to go there? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!